you look around the country and in places like Maryland, um, I'm proud to say, and you see a set of best practices when it comes to what it means to respect voters and their voice, whether it's accessing the ballot box or tackling the issue of uh, partisan gerrymandering, which we know is something that bedevils our democracy and drives people uh, crazy. So we have examples everywhere of what a national set of standards should look like that could preserve and protect our democracy. The problem is right now, without the ability in Washington to set those national standards for the country, we're sliding towards two Americas. One America where it's relatively easy and convenient to get to the ballot box, where you have confidence that your voice and your vote will be heard. And another America where it's increasingly difficult and you're seeing voter suppression. Remember, the goal here is just to allow an expansive and diverse electorate to be able to show up every two years at the ballot box. But we're going to have one America where you can do that, another America where you cannot. 